What's up, ladies and gents? And if you're new to the channel, my name is Shaka Zulu, and I'm back here for another video. And today, guys, today, we're gonna be trying disposable carts, man. Are disposable carts really worth it? I don't know, man, you never know. Sometimes they're worth it, sometimes they feel like they're worth it, sometimes they don't feel like they're worth it, so you know, I'm gonna talk about that, but. Also, we're just trying a new disposable. This is a saucepan. I don't really try disposables that much because of the, the simple reason and the simple fact that they even, sometimes they don't even put half grams. They put like 0.3. I think this one's a half gram. Let me check it out one more time. Yeah, this one's a half grammar. All, it's called all gas saucepan. It's an indica dominant and it's by crew. Shout out to crew. But I wanted to try out a disposable just to see how it tastes. Is it really worth it? And tell you guys my opinion if it's worth buying or not. So let's open this baby up. Let's see what it let's see what it's all about. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. The taste and scent, it says diesel, earth, earthy, pungent, and pine. Sensation, it says hungry, relaxed, sleepy, calm. So it's a freaking indica dominant, so it's more of a nighttime thing. Good thing the sun's kind of going down. You know what I'm saying? The sun's kind of going down out here. As you guys can see, I'm so happy that the sun's going down, man. It was hot as a motherfucker today, man. But next week, we're supposed to get like a heat wave, so pray for your boy, man. Pray for your boy. All right. I'll give them an A1. I give them an A1 on their packaging and because they actually tell you like what your taste is gonna be like. Um, and you know, the packaging just looks sick. They put it in two different packaging. You got the box and then you got a little plastic one. Okay. All right, off jumps. Off jump, I can already smell the like lemon smell. It's like very earthy, pun like it says diesel earthy pungent pine. I do get a pine, but it's a little bit of a lemon smell too. Also, man, I'm surprised they didn't put that on the um on the description. It has a little bit of that lemon taste, which you usually don't find in indicas. I feel like you usually find that more with like sativa um stuff like that or sativa um sativa weed or concentrate or whatever sorry i'm messing up on my words today but this one's definitely smells super good we're gonna try it out man let's test it out man i've been talking for too long let's see what it tastes like Ooh. Okay, it doesn't taste anything like it smells. Like it has more of a strong pine lemon t smell, but it tastes more piney. A little bit of a tad of sweetness, but not too much. But the reason why I don't like smoke disposables that much is literally like, it's just, it's cheaper to buy a one gram cartridge or something like that. Disposables, I feel like when you're buying a disposable, it's for that weekend, man. You're about to be going out, chilling with your boys, having a night out in the city, drinking a little bit. So it's like your three, three night, like something that you have for three days. You're gonna chief it with the boys probably while you're getting drunk at the club, at the bars for the weekend type thing. That's usually why I don't buy them that much. But if you're, if you're not an occasional smoker, if you're a person that only smokes sometimes, then I would definitely get a disposable, but it's just not, you know, it all comes out to the cost. Cause this thing was like, for just a half gram, it was probably like, I think it was like 30, 35. It was kind of a little expensive little thing. Plus tax, all that shit, man. Because you end up, I feel like you end up paying for the battery and stuff like that. And it's a rechargeable battery, which is cool. A lot of um, disposables don't have rechargeable batteries, but this is cool. It has a rechargeable one just in case.
But yeah, guys, I just wanted to do a quick review. On a scale of one to 10, let's just do it like this. Taste-wise, I'd give it a eight high. I'm starting to feel a little high now. It takes a couple hits. It only took a couple puffs, and I take light puffs. I'm at about like a five right now on the high scale, but it's a nice little high. Obviously, I could be higher, but that's just because I didn't take super fat rips off of this thing. I'll probably feel higher as, um, as you know, the time progresses after I get off the vlogs and stuff. I'll probably feel a little higher. Because I feel like sometimes I just gradually get high. Like I could smoke a good amount and then it stops smoking and then I'll start getting higher as the time goes on. But in my opinion, is it worth it? it it's not worth it in my opinion, just for the simple fact that the cost, I feel like you can get a better pen, full gram. But if you're a person that doesn't smoke like that, you're an occasional smoker, you're going out in the town with the boys, whatever you know you're doing, you just want a little quick, little sum sum for the weekend to get you through. This is perfectly, this is perfect for you. This is perfect. A nice little half gram because you're you're not a person that smokes a lot, so it's not worth buying a full gram because they might just be sitting there for a long. But I hope you guys enjoyed the review, man. More vlogs to come, man. Remember to eat, breathe, smoke weed. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Y'all guys know the vibes. And yeah, man, so Sauce Crew. Crew actually has good brand stuff. Their stuff is always usually tastes pretty good and hits pretty well. So I'm not surprised this actually is a pretty good pen. It's just that it's not something that I will buy all the time. Um, it's just something that, you know, I just wanted to try out and do a little video, maybe talk about disposables and stuff like that. So let me know what you guys want to see next, guys. I know I say that a lot, but I just like to still get your guys' ideas. But right now, recently, I've just been doing a lot more of the Animorphs uh, video or reading the Animorphs for you guys. So make sure you guys check that out. But we are going to get more nature sessions in maybe some blinker heads and all that other type of stuff so stay tuned for those vlogs guys man peace out i hope you guys have a good one man cheers Whew. but it's definitely a little tasty man it's a little tasty i like it i like it i like it it's a good pine sweet taste you know what i'm saying so, peace out, guys. Peace. And you can zoom in, whatever. That's where I'm going. Ooh. Mm -hmm.